everybody, Tim here for today's review of Doctor Who, story number 264, Sleep No More. I love how it rhymes. That's what happens when you're drunk. Everything, like, rhymes. Uh, I was a little disappointed. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm, I was, I was really kind of disappointed. Which is kind of weird, because, uh, Mark Gaddis wrote this episode. I think that's how you say his name. And I typically really like him. Like, as an actor, as a writer, everything. Like, I think he's really great. Like, if you haven't watched Sherlock or Dracula or his other Doctor Who episodes, he's he's really, really on point. But at the same time, I do admire this episode because it's a found footage episode. Now, that being said, I don't know if I have ever liked a found footage movie or anything. Like, Blair Witch Project really kind of made it popular. But, I mean, there's so much. Like, wreck and, ev like, ugh, it's always a horror thing. And even this, it's a very horror-type episode, or trying to be. And I don't like, or Cloverfield's another one. Like, I, ugh, I, I've never liked a found footage thing. It's just not my type of style. So, I mean, this entire episode, if you refilmed it, got rid of the found footage, and just made it an episode... I could have loved it. I mean, I love Sandman. I love the song Sandman. I love everything about that. So, I mean, and it's an interesting plot. It's an interesting development. But the whole found footage, shaky camera, like, it just doesn't do it for me. So, that's what really knocked this one way, way down for me. And it's really disappointing because it's the first episode in a long time that I really haven't liked. So, and go figure, it's the first single episode for this season. Because this entire season, every episode has been a two-parter. So, overall, a little disappointed. So, curious whatever other people thought of it. Go ahead, let me know. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I'll see you guys next time for Face the Raven.